Hey everyone, it's me, Danny Hagen, your Pilates instructor with the Pilates Pro Chair team, and I am so excited to introduce you to the Pilates Pro Ring. Oh my goodness, this is one of my favorite props to use with Pilates, and I'm so excited we just added it to our line. So I'm going to take you through some foundational movements using just your Pilates Pro Ring, and you will be shocked at how incredible of a workout you can get using just your Pilates Pro Ring. So we're going to start standing up and we'll finish our series of exercises sitting down. So have a chair nearby. So to get started, you're standing up nice and tall. Let's talk about posture for just a moment. So you always want to think of that rib cage lifting up and out of the hips and pulling those abs in to stabilize the space that you just created between your hips and your ribs. So let's put the Pilates Pro Ring between the palms of your hands with the arms extended. Now I want you to take your thumbs and put them on the inside of your Pro Ring. And so you're going to be pulling your Pro Ring apart using just your thumbs. Now rather than pulling from your arms, I want you to be focused between the shoulder blades. So you're squeezing the shoulder blades together and in turn that pulls your Pilates Pro Ring apart. So let's do 10. Here we go. 10, 9, Eight, standing up nice and tall, pulling those abs in. Six, five, keep the shoulders down out of the ears. Three, two, and one. Now keep those arms extended, release your thumbs, and you're going to press your palms towards each other for 10. Nine, keeping those shoulders down. Seven, pull those abs in. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now bend your elbows, bring them, your Pilates Pro Ring in towards your chest. Again, keep those shoulders down and you'll press the palms towards each other again for 10, nine, eight, get a nice squeeze, seven, six, standing up nice and tall, five, four, three, two, this last one, let's hold it, holding for 10, nine, pull those abs in, seven, six, five, shoulders are down, three, two, and one, and release. Now extend the arms out in front of you. You'll bring your arms up overhead and keep the shoulders down and squeeze the hands together for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, shoulders out of the ears, three, abs are in, two, one. Now bend your elbows, put your Pilates Pro Ring on like a tiara and you'll squeeze the palms together. Keep the elbows lifted, shoulders down, and squeeze for 10. Nine, pull those abs in. Eight, seven, nice squeeze here. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Squeeze it and hold it. Keep those shoulders down and the elbows lifted. Abs are in, standing up tall. Five, four, three, two, one and release. Ooh, I've already got a nice rise in my temperature. I'm warming up a little bit. So now you're going to take your Pilates Pro Ring. You're going to take the cushion here and put it on top of your shoulder. So I've got it on my right shoulder and I'll take my right hand overhead, holding onto the top cushion. Use this cushion as a tactile cue to push that shoulder down out of the ear. Again, pulling the ribs in and take the hand down to the head for 10. Nine. This is actually one of my favorite, and I, I know I have a lot of favorites, but this one's really great to just isolate your bicep without activating your traps, which is a challenge. So this is one of my favorites. <laughs> Three, two, and one. Since it's my favorite, we're doing five more. Five, four, I tricked you, I know. Three, two, and one and release and we'll do the other side so you're putting the cushion on your left shoulder the left hand comes up overhead to hold onto the top cushion keep that shoulder down abs are in squeeze down one two three keep that collarbone open keep breathing and we've got five more coming up here we go for five four and release. Excellent, you feel that nice work right here in the bicep and of course the back of the arm as well. All right, so now you're going to take the cushion and you'll put it right underneath your bust line, right on top of the rib cage here, and take your hands to the front cushion. So notice how this makes a perfect frame for your arms. 
So you've got a nice little slope here. The elbow's just below the shoulder and the wrist is just below the elbow. So a nice little slope, standing up nice and tall. Again, you're squeezing between the shoulder blades to pull the fingertips towards the, the breastbone. And now you're going to twist over to the right and back to center, over to the left back to center. Try not to take your hips with you as you twist. So as I'm twisting to the left, I'm pulling my right hip back. So if I had headlights on my hips, they keep shining straight forward as I'm rotating from the torso. This gets deep into those obliques. Keep the shoulders down, squeeze those shoulder blades together behind you, and keep your hips shining straight forward. You're kind of counterbalancing. Twist to the right, pull that left hip back, back to center. Twist to the left, pull the right hip back, back to center. Let's do four more on each side. Four to center, four to center. So keep thinking of pulling the armpits down towards the hip bones and the rib cage is floating up out of the hips. The belly button's drawing in towards the spine. And we've got one more set in each direction. To the left. Back to center. Excellent. Now you'll take your Pilates Pro Ring. You're going to take the cushion and put it on your right hip. And take your right hand out to the side to the far cushion. Armpits are pulling down, so your collarbone's nice and wide and you're lengthening up through the neck. Squeeze your palm into your hip for 10. Now you can get a soft bend in your elbow here, that's fine. The length of your arm will make a difference of your arm placement. Five, float those ribs up. Four, three, two. This is great for that back of the arm. Last one, squeeze it and hold it. Keep breathing. Lift up that rib cage. Keep it nice and tight. Five, four, three, two, one, and release. Excellent. Now we'll do the other side. So you're putting the cushion on your left hip. Your left hand is to the far cushion. Float those ribs up. Draw them nice and tight. Shoulder down and squeeze for 10. Nice and stable through the torso here. So just your arm is pulling in. You do a nice work in your lats and your serratus muscle. That underarm that's so hard to target, you know the one where you wave and the arm jiggles? This one's great for that. <laughs> Three more. Three, two, keep that shoulder down. Last one, squeeze and hold it for 10. Nine, work those abs. Eight, seven, lifting up. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and release. Now let's grab our chairs and we'll set up for the second half of this series of exercises. All right, so the second half of this exercise series, we're taking your wonderful Pilates Pro Ring. You're seated on your chair and place your Pilates Pro Ring between your knees. So the cushion comes to the inside of the thighs here. Sitting up nice and tall, float the ribs up out of the hips. For a little extra stabilization, you can hold onto the bottom of your chair and notice I'm sitting towards the edge of the chair for a little extra range of motion and stability on the floor. So you can either hold onto the bottom of your chair or if you'd like to advance it, give me genie arm, stack one arm on top of the other, drop those shoulders down, pull those lower abs in. Now you'll squeeze your knees together. 10, nine, sitting up nice and tall, eight, Three, just working those inner thighs. Two, last one, squeeze and hold it. As you're holding, run through those checkpoints. Float the ribs up, pull the lower abs in, drop the shoulders down, squeeze the shoulder blades together and lengthen through the neck. Good. Now little pulses. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and release. Excellent. Now you're going to stabilize through your left leg. So your left leg doesn't move and you're just working your right leg, pulling your right leg into the midline and release. Squeeze, release. Eight, sitting up tall. Seven, six, five, four, lower abs pulling in. Three, lengthen through the spine. Two, last one, squeeze and hold it. Great time to run through that checklist again, really lengthening out through the spine as tall as you can. Little pulses with the right leg only. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and release. Oh, I love that inner thigh burn. Now we're doing the left side. So change the cross of your arms if you're in genie arms. 
You're stabilizing through the right leg, just pulling the left leg into your midline. Here we go. 10, nine, shoulders back. Eight, keep breathing. Six, five, four, three, lengthen through that neck. Two, last one, squeeze and hold it. Lengthening up through that spine. Lengthen through the neck, squeeze the shoulder blades together. Little pulses with just the left leg. 10, nine, eight. So the torso and the right leg aren't moving, you're stabilizing, that left leg is challenging you. One, and squeeze and hold, and release. Awesome. Now, we're gonna thread your legs through your Pilates curl ring and put it on the outside of your knees. So it's up above the bone, it's more of a fleshy part of your thigh. So open your knees to about hip distance apart so that your Pilates Pro ring sits nice and secure here. Again, you're sitting up nice and tall. Give me genie arms. And this time you're pulling your knees apart. So we'll run through that same series. So open the knees and release. Open and release. So you're working those outer thighs. My mom loves to target this area. So do I. <laughs> Six, five, pull those abs in. Four, shoulders down. Three, two, last one. Pull those knees open and hold. Lengthening up, shoulders are down. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. Pulse it open for 10, nine, eight, seven. Abs are in. Five, four, three, two, and one. And release. Same thing as before. Now you're stabilizing through your left leg. Just pulling that right leg out. Here we go for 10, nine, eight. So you really have to use your abs to keep your torso stable. Five, four, three, two. Last one, open and hold it. You should start feeling a nice burn on that right hip right about now. Sitting up nice and tall, holding that knee open. Little pulses, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and release. Change the cross of your arms. Left side, here we go. Pull that left knee open and pull it back in. Open and in. Load those ribs up out of those hips. Seven, six, five. Lengthen through the neck by pulling the shoulders down. Three, two, last one. Hold it open here. Lengthening up, shoulders are down and back. Collarbones nice and wide. Pull those abs in. Little pulses for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, and release. Woo! And that is a fun full body workout with your Pilates Pro Ring. I hope you love it as much as I do. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks!